The Nervous Spider Story Once upon a time, in a deep forest, lived a spider named Adrian. One day as Adrian was waiting for some flies to get caught in the web, he fell asleep. He slept for a long time and finally woke up to the sound of the rustling of leaves and the webs. He quickly went over to look and he saw a little fly stuck on his web and was trying to escape. Adrian felt bad for the fly as he knew he would soon have to eat it. He did not like the fact he had to kill someone to survive but he knew that it was the law of nature. Thinking about this, he slowly moved towards the prey. Fly stuck in the web. As he was walking lost in his thoughts another spider bicker came and mocked Adrian for being weak as he thought it was a display of weakness to think about flies. Bicker said, Adrian, are you too scared to kill the fly? Adrian hated moments like this but he calmly replied no. It is only that I hope to have found some way to survive without eating bugs. Bicker laughed and mocked Adrian. As Adrian reached the bug, the bug begged for his life and cried for help. Adrian was astonished to hear a bug speak. Adrian asked, Hey fly, how is it that I can hear you speak? I have never heard a fly speak in spider language. The fly replied, I have lived around spiders. Hence I know how to speak the spider language. The fly further explained that he lived in a faraway part of the forest where flies and spiders live in harmony. He then said that the spiders there do not eat flies, rather they eat the plant buds. Hearing that Adrian was in shock, he was not able to believe that it was possible to survive without feeding on others. The fly proposed if he let him go, he would take Adrian to the place and other spiders could teach Adrian how to live a vegetarian life. Adrian thought for a moment and let the fly free. The fly quickly disappeared into the sky. Bicker, the second spider saw all these and taunted Adrian as to how weak he was. Bicker said, that fly fooled you Adrian and he would never come back. Adrian saving the fly. Adrian waited for the fly and as time passed by, he started losing hope and thought that Bicker was right. Just as he was about to sleep, the fly came along with his friends. They took Adrian to the far end of the forest where flies and spiders lived together. Adrian quickly learned to live a vegetarian life and he lived happily ever after. Moral of the Spider Story This was the Nervous Spider short story. The story depicts the moral lesson of trusting each other. It was because Adrian trusted in the fly that he let the fly go out and saved his life. Similarly, because the fly knew that Adrian wanted to do good, the fly returned to Adrian. The story also teaches that if we really try hard, there will always be a solution to the problem. Trust is one of the most important virtues of life. In conclusion of the article, The Nervous Spider Story is a short tale of the spider and the bug. The story depicts the journey of the spider from being a predator to a friend of the fly. A small tip for parents is to read several short stories to kids. This will not only help kids to develop moral values in their life but also widen their vocabulary.